I feel like Vitafly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime roll. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That one was crazy out of the game. Sometimes that's Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the Vitafly. We used to rapping like that. Yo, yo, man, leave, leave Harlem alone, bro. You got, you got, like people from Harlem. Mm. You just gotta leave them alone because, like the Rexes, the Mooks, like the way they talk, they talk real Pinot Gris. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like they talk is real filthy. You feel? You know what I'm saying? Like feel what they, 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 they go crazy from the get go. And a matter of fact, that's our intro. Mm -hmm. uh, you, you know who he is. You know who I am. So let's get yeah. to it, man. Murder Mook. Like, he's talking Pinot Grigio, real filthy, real nasty. Like, he he was, like, we're going to get into the things that he said in the Uncle uh, Rod interview, 15 Minutes of Fame, salute to Uncle Rod, uh, you know what I'm saying? Get and everything me that, on the bar exam. He wants to be on the bar exam, I get him on there. Um, so, salute to uh, 15 Minutes of Fame, everything that they got going on over there. Uh, <sighs> murder move. <laughs> I just want to start... Mookie, your bars is whack and your lingo. I ain't puff, I don't dance the jingles. I pop your top like a can of Pringles. With respect, to, rest in peace and respect to Party Artie. Party Artie. Um, I, so, I was about to say, that's, a, that's, that's Party Artie. Okay. Every time I speak about that battle, I always rap Party Artie's raps. Because Party Artie had the, you repping your crew, stepping the who. I don't eat pussy, but I make the exception for you. And you don't know what the weapon to do. I'm like, you don't remember that's what a smack is? No, nah, I remember did. that. Like, like, when you hear it yeah. now, it's like, oh. I wanna pop this nigga up, but I ain't tripping. I'ma chop this nigga up like Chinese chicken. Like I remember like damn near the whole battle, dog. Cause that's like one of the, we used to watch that shit over and over and over and over. The party already was was fire. But uh so Murder Mook, who's became like the baseline, the benchmark, the 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 logo, a lot of these things in battle rap, you know what I'm saying? And and I get it, like different people from different places don't have the same level of admiration or respect for a mook that I would have being from New York. Mm. But so check this out. Uh his battle with Briz Rothstein is not happening. Uh you know I'm still hurt. We, we <laughs> the investigation still goes on. We <laughs> have so. so so uh Mook said he's over the battle. Does this battle ever happen? I ain't gonna lie to you. I'm over it. Six months down the line, a year now. down the line. I'm over it. He's like, he don't want to do it six months from now, you know what I'm saying? Like, he's not trying to do it no fucking December or no shit like that. Like, Briz kind of, like, backed out of it. Uh, the way URL went about it, they went about it to throw Briz Rossi under the bus, and that's pretty much what happened. Mm -hmm. Um, what you think about him being over it? Do you feel like, you'd like, that makes sense? Like, him not wanting to do it no more? I, I can understand it. I mean, it's one of, it's one of those things where it's bittersweet. Mm -hmm. Like, of course, I want this to go down still. Of course, I want this battle to happen. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, it, you know, now it's just spoiled milk. It's like, I don't even want to smell it. Like, it's, right. I know it's bad. So I don't even want to force it. Let it go. I, I feel I feel on that, on that end. Um, but the fact still remains is that, you know, now the main events have moved. Right. And, uh, you know, they, it's too short of a notice for Mook to battle, mm -hmm. you know, to, to his standards. Yeah. And I, I can understand why he's over it. Uh, I still want to see Mook sooner than later, not in another six months. Probably the next event. Like, I'm pretty sure they should be negotiating his next opponent. Yeah. So they can still work out whatever the agreement they had. And they can say, listen, instead of that for Briz, whatever you want for this cat. You know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. That, after that, you know, for Briz, cooler heads can prevail. We don't know where that is going with it and where business is going on that end. We still don't know where he is. But I still understand why you would be over. Now, the question I have for you is... Uh where was you and what when you heard that it wasn't how was your what was your initial reaction like when you heard it wasn't happening you know what i'm saying like it, it wasn't going well, like how you, i knew you was at work but i was like, at what work. was your initial thought and and you know because i was about to quote bad boys i was at a family barbecue mm -hmm. but no i was at work and um when they was talking about it like i thought they was playing mm -hmm. i'm like because y'all was just talking about this like a couple days ago like right, it's right, about right. to be monumental um, and then when once uh, I knew it was wasn't going down because you could tell by the other host they was they was a little distraught like they just finding that out too. Yeah. Then you get Mook on the FaceTime popping in. It's solidified. I was hurt. You know what I'm saying? Like it wasn't. You know, like damn. You know, I'm not gonna watch Summer Madness. That's stupid. I'm mm -hmm. just saying. 
damn what y'all gonna do. That is, I, I don't know. Uh, we got, I got two more directions that I wanna go with this conversation. Um, first and foremost, you know, I was watching it on the um, stream or whatever the case may be, and I saw that it was, it was not happening. And you know, so many people ask so many different questions. And initially, everybody had their initial response and reaction to it, like, yo, he's crazy, yada, 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 what the fuck is going on? But, you know, like I said, the way, it's all about presentation. The way it was presented, it was presented in a manner that is to make him look bad. Like, it was yeah. not presented in a manner that makes it like, we're working with it, mm. we're trying to make, no, it was thrown out there like, yo, the trash can. media, get him. You know what I'm saying? Mm. It was handed on a platter like, the battle was presented, he took the deposit. Everything that you need to make a blog that did 70,000 views or whatever views it did on our channel was presented expeditiously. Yeah. He, he took the deposit, <laughs> the battle was arranged, he backed out. When you use those type of words and you put them words in a blender and throw them out there, people will eat that up, you know what I'm saying? So, um, I, I thought that they put up this, the per it's called a smear campaign. That's, That's exactly call what it's called. They put, yep. <laughs> they put a smear we, they put a smear. What do we know about Briggs? We, he takes money and he runs the, from the biggest stage. Like they do with the presidential campaigns. He eats puppies. Like, <laughs> like, like stuff like his, that, man. Like, his motto was perfect attendance. <laughs> like, but does he really have perfect attendance? You know what I'm saying? It was a perfect smear campaign set up for him. But in regards to uh, the situation, you have to look at it like they put a, there's a lot of money behind what's going on here. You know, um, back in the days when you all had a lot of the events that weren't on um, obvious big, big streaming platforms or that weren't on pay-per-view. If you remember, Born Legacy 3? Mm -hmm. uh, Born Legacy 3, let me think of some of the battles that happened on that card. Uh, it was like Dre Dennis versus J400, uh, Reaper Rail battled against, uh, what's my man's name? Um, what's the dude? He battled, Reaper Rail battled somebody on there. I forgot Cat's name. Uh, he, he's from New Orleans. And there was a bunch of other battles on that card. I think, Matter of fact, I want to get this right. I don't. I, I want. I don't like putting out, like you know, because we get it wrong a lot of the time. So, uh, I, I got you. I got you. I got you. Born Legacy Three URL. Um, let's do this. I, I want to get this right. Uh, let's get it right. I want to get it right. I want to get it right. Um, Mo Moolah. No, Reaper Rail Battle Gutter. Gutter. And, uh, he's, and he's from. He's from. He's from. He sure is. Yes. Yeah. That's crazy. Uh, that was Rum Nitty vs. Ill Will. Mm -hmm. The law grab the nose. I'm coming down with mm -hmm. something. That was uh, Mr. Wavy was supposed to battle Young Ill. Young yeah. Ill didn't show up. Uh, Av battled. Was supposed to battle Be Magic. That didn't happen either. Chess vs. The Saga happened on that. Mm -hmm. I don't remember Chess vs. Saga. I do remember that. Tink the Demon vs. Wave Seven happened on there. I do I remember, remember that. that. Yeah. Uh, Daylight vs. Mike P. Yeah, that was on that. Yeah, that was on that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Damn. Prep vs. Lot of Zay when he came with a t shirt with a mom on him. Uh, New Jersey Twerk vs. Dougie. Ah, uh, Papa Idol. Ah, Man, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, I say that to say this. That was in a time where battles was not on pay per view. You know what I'm saying? Like, with no pay per view, it was yeah, none of that stuff. You just you heard about it. You just heard about it. It was folklore. It yeah. was folklore. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I say that to say, in those days, a lot of these battles, people got, there was back outs. Mr. Wavy got backed out on by none none. B Magic didn't show up for Av. Mm -hmm. uh, who else didn't show up? Uh, like Hill didn't show up. Young Hill right? didn't show up mm -hmm. for Mr. Wavy. Mm -hmm. uh, it was a couple people that just didn't show up, right? Yeah. Momula didn't battle Young X, Young X didn't show up. I knew so, Momula was on that card. What I'm saying is, back then, if you backed out, it was just an issue with the league. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like the league, they they just ban you for a couple of years and then you come back later. But now you got big streaming platforms involved, big money involved, caffeine's involved. They got that big bag involved. They ain't trying to hear that shit. You know what I'm saying? So I think it, it's like this is he picked the wrong time. He might have did the right thing for himself, but he picked the wrong time to do it. Yeah. Um. Long story being short, you know what I mean? That's just where they stand right now. That battle's not happening. But... They were saying, who would Mook want to battle? True. I think... Mm -hmm. I think Murder Mook's next battle is against Tay Rock. I can see that. Take that, put it in an envelope, and take it to the bank. You know what battle I I think it's versus 
Tay Rock. And that sounds great. He Who do you think is against? Performance. He had a great performance versus Daylight. Tay Rock deserves murder. Who do you think is against? I'm gonna tell you why it ain't. I'm glad I put it to you like this. Who do you think is against? There's only one ain't. person in my mind. Who do you think is against? I'm gonna tell you why it ain't. Charlie Clips. No, not gonna happen. Murder Mook is the only one from Dot Mob yeah. that Charlie Clips has not battled. I don't think it's going to happen with Charlie Clips because Charlie Clips has got to continue to prove some kind of consistency. It, you know what I'm saying? I mean, that's and, fine. And when you but we're talking about Mook, history, though. We're talking yeah, about history. The history is more so, it's a better storyline with Rock, though. Both used to be Dot Mob. There's all the shit talking. You know what I'm saying? Like, the history, I feel like the history is better against Tay Rock. And it, Charlie Clips, it, although I rock with Clips, he mm -hmm. shouts us out in his joints and all it, that. The consistency it, just isn't there. I'm not saying that Rock does not deserve that battle. I'm not saying that at all. Rock 100%. Everybody that, that is up top and got a tier, when Mook's name is brought up, that is a name that not a lot of people can say that they It's the end game. You see what I'm saying? Yes. It's the final boss. Yeah. It's the legend. It's, it's not even the final boss. It's Mewtwo. For all of my Pokemon nerds out there, you gotta actually beat the game, then go through the cave to get to Mewtwo. I wouldn't know. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's a whole thing. But, um, and then you gotta get the birds. But you, yeah. you gotta do all of that just to get to this one, to get to the one that started it all. Mewtwo is the one that, well, Mew is the one that's, but you get what I'm saying. I don't get it, but I get You, you don't I get got, what I'm saying. I got, I got you, I got you. You get what I'm saying. But, <laughs> With with that, uh, I got three. It's three names. Mm -hmm. Rock is up there, Charlie Clips is up there, and Hollow is up there. Hollow not gonna happen. I yeah. understand that. <laughs> I told you what Hollow's not gonna happen. Uh, no, cause who uh, we got? No, Hollow. Um, Hollow should have another battle later this year, but it's not gonna be against uh, Mook because Hollow and Mook were supposed to battle in 2019, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. he, 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 I was told that they both got their deposits or whatever the case may be, and the battle never happened, right? When you book battlers, you pay for time. Mm -hmm. So if you book them to battle in June of 2019, mm -hmm. if that battle doesn't happen in June, July, or August, battle goes on about their way. Money gets spent. Money's definitely now, if you want to book them in October of 2020, guess what they're going to say? Mm -hmm. You got to pay me again. Yeah. So rather than a league booking the same battlers twice and having to pay again, you know what I'm saying? They're not going to... Um, I don't understand that, though. That's that's like burning me out my money. Like, I don't... I, I don't... I will never understand that part. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like... There's got to be some type of back out insurance or there's got to be some type of rescheduling insurance. You know what I'm saying? Like It has to be something, some type of compensation. Because even if the battle's not going down right now, it can still potentially happen later. And then it has the opportunity to go to another league and right. then y'all think about another bag. That's fine at all, but what about my money that I just gave y'all for a battle that y'all didn't go through? You know, like, I, I can't fathom that. Right. So... I mean, if Tay Rock decides to, I mean, if Tay Rock takes that mantle, only thing I want Tay Rock to do is knock that tree down even further. You know what I'm saying? Verb proved that Mook can bleed. He right. did. And then not to mention, Mook shot back up with the social distance, but he was battling the playground. Right, The right. same playground that, Te uh, that Rex had tripped over the caution tape. I seen it. Mm -hmm. All I'm saying is, Rock ain't gonna play with you, Mook, and I know Mook ain't gonna play with Rock. Not at all. But those, I'm just saying, Hollow and Charlie is also two legendary names that I just like. That those why. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I like all of the three. Like, first of all, I like the I like a Charlie Clips battle, but I would need a Charlie Clips serious. Uh, no games being played. He needs to write all his material. Somebody needs to survey that shit and make sure he actually wrote it because we ain't have you freestyling his murder move. Uh, if he beats done. the shit out of uh, uh, Geechee, though, would Geechee it be? ain't never been smoked, though. But and now, if that, oh, oh. Now, listen here. Oh, oh. Just say oh, oh, You oh. say he need that performance. What if yeah. Charlie come out? What if he, what if Charlie knows? If he got, if Charlie got me like this, mm -hmm. if Charlie got me like, get, if, if I got to send this to Compton? Yeah. Oh, you got to go ahead and All I'm that. saying is, all I'm saying is, you, you, you just said Charlie has to have that, that one performance. If Charlie just so happens to smoke Geechee, we oh, don't know crazy. how it, I'm oh, just that saying, crazy. that name shoots right on up, I don't want to hear no other talk, that's the, because you know that's what Charlie's going to do. Mm -hmm. He's going to be like, alright, listen, I, listen, I beat one of your kings, oh, I beat yeah. one of your main shooters, uh, yeah, I played with Rump, that was years ago, but, I, uh, but you see what I did to twerk? Oh yeah, okay, so count those wins, yeah. give me Mook, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it probably had to happen then. 
Okay, um, but Murder Moop was talking spicy about other rappers. Exactly. I was going. I was going. Don't worry. We was going. Oh, I was going there. We oh, don't worry. I was bad. going there. My bad. Don't worry. I, had, hey. I was putting my shoes on. Let the drum roll. You gotta get some shrimp, mm -hmm. some peas, some fry to all put in the gumbo. gumbo. You know what I'm saying? It. I got. I got to cook it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We got to. We got to. My bad. <laughs> we gonna cook them. That's just that simmer. That's sound. that simmer sound. Right. Simmer down. <laughs> so, on the same interview with Uncle Rod. 15 minutes of fame. He starts talking about Ryder. I seen a nigga with the cute little shirt. What's his name? Nigga be wearing oh, the cute gear. Yeah. Ryder, you got shirt. you out your mind, man. <laughs> Tell Ryder to come jump in one in a cipher with me on this camera. I don't know what Ryder said in an interview about Murder Mook or whatever the case may be, but Murder Mook. Yo, them Harlem niggas know how to make you mad. I bet him, I bet Ryder, I bet, what do we got, 2,500? Ryder, I bet you 2,500, you come jump. And a cipher would be on this camera and just we just say raps together. And get under your skin. <laughs> uh, he basically said that uh, he's an uncle. He's <laughs> the uncle in the house that don't know. He don't know none of the nieces and nephew names. All right. Right. Yeah, don't know. Do, you know the one with the big ass head? You, you know the one I'm talking about. Oh, junior, Junior, yeah, 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 yeah Junior. Because I seen Ryder tweet, Murder Mook, hop out there with me in a cypher, it's going to get real hypocritical, I promise you. Mm. You know what I'm saying? And then he tweeted again, saying that uh, this nigga Murder Mook out his effing mind. This is what you not want to do, bro. Cypher, you say right, fuck it, let's make it happen. Because Murder Mook basically said if Ryder jumped into a cypher with him, he'll piss his pants. He called him the... <laughs> what he call what do you call him? He said, what's the nigga? He's like, yeah, you know, them young, the young niggas talking crazy. What's the nigga with the cute shirts? Oh, my God, yo. Like, yo. <laughs> oh, Ryder. Yeah, 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 Ryder. Like, he literally hit you with the uncle move. He's like, yeah, I was down there on the block. I'm saying, you know what? You know, uh, uh, Nisi, Nisi son, Nisi son. The nigga that got the, he be coming here with the Cheetos on his fingers. Oh, my God. <laughs> Why? Why you with the nose? He got the like snot that. down his nose. You know what I'm talking about. My little snotty. Snotty. Why did Moo shoot at Ryder like that, though? It, I mean, it was more warranted. I can understand the animosity that Moo has right now. He, he's building smoke with whoever. Listen, don't right. bring nobody over here that they ain't ready to get smoked. And I feel that. Mm -hmm. He's saying a cypher. Now, Ryder is, he does music, and his music's really good. His, no, not really good. His music's better than Moo's. <laughs> Music-wise, I'm sorry. Yeah, his music is better. Yeah. I'm just saying. I, I got no... Now, we could go... Rap, 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 raps, move. Move. Right, yeah, what I'm if we talking a cipher, battle raps. Yeah, if we talking move. a cipher, and uh, yeah, when I think of ciphers, I think of like Mook taking over. I take a, I think of Goods taking over. Uh, uh, Mickey Fax is known oh, to yeah, do yeah, a killer cipher, and um, and uh, 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 uh shit. Chess in a he's cipher? Sorry, yeah, chess goes he's crazy. fire. So like I said, I can I can I just don't see Ryder in a Lux. lot of you know, maybe a young show Tom S P in a cipher, you know what I'm saying? Cause I heard he was nice in some ciphers. Oh yeah, I got it. Yeah. But but you know what I'm saying? But if we talk about in a cipher, I would like to see Rod, you know, hop in there, but I ain't going to, he better not start taking shots at Mook in the cipher. That's all I'm saying. Just, Chilla you know, Jones said he was gonna get his dumb ass smoked. That's what Chilla Jones said. <laughs> Yeah. It's plenty of people Ryder can, can battle right now. You know what I'm saying? I just watched him versus Loso and I got Loso winning. Like I is with Ryder, the, the talk is there, the the, the 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 brand is there, the silk shirt, like I like all of that. You know what I'm saying? It is it's cute shirts. Oh but but you can't be out but here. But Mook did give him props about battle rap wise. Yeah. He said he's he said he's a dope battle rapper. But he was like rapping wise, like rapping, like getting in front of me and rapping, like you can't out rap me or whatever. Out -rap. And that makes sense. It, it makes one hundred percent sense because Mook is where he's at, and and that's and he, I father, he, Rod, they, none of these young niggas is gonna say this nigga has fathered a lot of you. Right. Anything like any when we talk about battle rap, and if you were writing a book or or trying to do how to battle rap. There's different people that you watch. Like with Mook, it was the back-to-back -back punch lines, mm -hmm. the heavy, loud projection. You know what I'm saying? Like that's Mook. When you think of Verb, you think of the intricacy of the bars in your painting that you're building the house. When you think of Big T, you're thinking of the sound effects. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like it, these are niggas that are fathers. And you think so, about, like when you think about daylight, you think of the complex wordplay. Come you know, on. Like, it, you think of you think of the people. So when you're when you're doing your stuff, when you no battle rapper coming up right now 
is going to be as original as the original. No. You're only going to be a glimpse or, or I see a little bit of that in him. I, or I see him in, in him. You, mm. It's never somebody that's like, yo, this nigga's different. And right. it's going to be rare. But if you can combine all of that, mm -hmm. then you, or master all of that, mm -hmm. or you have the, the, the history or the battle, you know, uh, 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 career and the, and the, uh, the, the resume, mm -hmm. then you can talk to Mook. Right. Ryder, you know, Mike P, that's the low soul. He was in Ultimate Madness. He didn't go through, he didn't win Ultimate. Like, you didn't say, like, Ryder doesn't have the accolades to see Mook yet. But then mm -hmm. again, I got one question, what the Street Hems do to get Mook? Mmm. Just, yeah, okay. So, I, I, like I said, I love being a devil's advocate. You know, mm. leave the comments in a second. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. But yeah, uh, yeah, it is what it is, man. I mean, Murder Mook, uh, like I said, the thing about everybody knows, especially from, from New York, mm. there's a certain way, like niggas from Harlem. They just have a slick, like a talk or bottom where they could get you out. Like Rex. Rex hasn't really done nothing notable in a while. Yeah. But the way he get to talking, he get to talking. Yeah, he he, yo, that camera, when that when he's around, that camera get to rolling. Look, look at what he did. Yo. <laughs> look at what he did. I fed niggas when they ain't had no food. I gave this nigga the last french fries in my box. I gave this nigga the fries in my bag. Now you want to talk about me because he got his own fries? That's that disloyal shit. Like, he can talk. What, what, what Rex say? He's like, he's like, in the state of New York, it is illegal to carry a hammer. This nigga had a hammer. <laughs> no, no, not a hammer. Like but a, a hammer. <laughs> he's like, I'm like, oh, this nigga about to look. <laughs> Rex yo, is like, my whole nigga's funny, man. They talk yo, yo. A different talk, and it gets people in there. Like, you. Ryder must have, Mook just said that one statement in the, um, in the <laughs> and I immediately cried. Ryder has had like 15 tweets, like he was tweeting, he was on Instagram, yeah, that. He, 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 got him, he got him in his feelings. I mean, because it's Mook, you know what I'm saying? I remember when uh, Mook battled Verb, and he was like, he like sat down to break down all his bars, like he felt a way about anybody who felt like he didn't win. Yeah, he really did. You know what I'm saying? He was he had a whole feeling. interview. He had a whole interview. Yeah, a whole interview breaking down his bars. Like in the first round, I said, boo, 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 boo. I said, why no? Right, why no? I jacked Dan, yo, that's it's whiskey, whiskey business. business. See, like, they didn't even understand the on top. I was like, yo, we, this we, nigga. We got that, boo. We just. He was hot. Uh, but he definitely just got it. That's why, like, in the third round, that's why, like, they wasn't even listening to Mook. And the funny thing is, Mook is throwing, he's throwing the bait out there for Ryder, mm. you know what I'm saying? But he's like the Thanos of battle rap, you know what I'm saying? Like, he's not gonna, look, when I, when I say that, he's, he knows that he's not gonna respond to Ryder on Twitter. He's not gonna go back and forth with him. He can say, let's battle for it, let's, let's bet for a cypher. He's not gonna do it. But he's just saying it mm. to set you up for the end game. But, uh, you already know what to do and what it does, so you gotta ask what it was.